now we are starting the epilogue the last three missions from this game and i think the first one is called festung recogni and uh i believe that this one is like the last mission from the american campaign so let's see exactly uh what it is since june of 1944 the allies have made enormous advances through europe sweeping through much of france belgium and holland almost to the banks of the rhine much of their success must be credited to the russians who at stalingrad during the winter of 1943 destroyed many of the germans best panzer divisions on the eastern front the russians have continued to push the germans back through russia and much of poland and will soon be on the banks of the oder river and the border of germany the situation for the germans has grown desperate allied bombers have reduced many major german cities to rubble the German Air Force, the Luftwaffe, is a mere shadow of the power it once was and can do little to stop the bombers, much less fight the Allied armies. The Kriegsmarine, the German Navy, is mostly sunk, its U-boats destroyed and its sailors pressed into the army. However, the enemy refuses to surrender. Unable to stop the Allied advance, Hitler has turned to vengeance weapons, the V-1 and now the V-2 rockets. These rockets, although some of the most advanced weapons of the war, are too inaccurate to hit military targets. Instead, they are being used to terrorize London. Gentlemen, we fought a whole bunch of these, so I know you know what to do, but indulge me. Move quickly, cover your buddies, don't bunch up. And for heaven's sake, don't stop till we reach those bunkers. Roger that. Let's go. Objective, capture all enemy documents. Two left. Two out of two practically, so. We have mines around. My dude is dead. Rest in peace. So now, uh, I believe that we have three missions. And I believe that each mission is from uh, each campaign practice so first the american british and after that is russian i mean soviet mission soviet campaign so uh, i guess that these are like the last missions that will end the game for each of these man he's dressed in white in snow barely barely see him so these three are like the last missions from each uh, campaign Okay. Fire. It's tough to have like those, uh, you know, white enemies. Like when you have snow, they are dressed in white. It's pretty hard to see them. I mean, it's a pretty good camouflage. Not to mention that for some reason it is a bit foggy or something. I don't know. It's even harder to see them. Okay, I need to go down. Do not shot my friend. You animals. Whoa, whoa. How dare you. Good night. You just died. Advanced brothers, but I cannot go inside. Yes, I can. Give me a moment to reload. First document. Document! Okay, I have a rocket launcher here. But I cannot... Take it, unfortunately, because I need to have a pistol, a weapon, and my sniper, so. Okay, so now we need to go and find a second bunker. Moving, Let's go, guys. Okay, the second bunker is over there. We need to play smart, because they have machine guns.
I love this uh, World War II games. I actually love them. I, I played, I think, two or three times the Call of Duty 2. Because in the first time I did, they knew about this one. Damn it. For some reason I thought that Call of Duty 1 was made like for consoles, you know, not for a PC. Man! But... Now I learned that they are for PC as well, so I said, okay, if I play this on YouTube, let's try... Uh, let's start with the first one. Because that's how you play a franchise from first to last. In most of the cases, of course. But as I said, I played Call of Duty a lot. Call of Duty 2. And I loved it. But now, to be honest, I think everyone uh, loves more the other Call of Duties, you know? That are like more in present time. You are in cities and do stuff, missions. But World War II missions games are pretty nice as well. Are much better than those modern ones, but... I do not care that much, to be honest. I love older games, I love new games. <clears throat> Somehow for me, uh, old games have something... I don't know, a, a good vibe when you play them. I, I do not know how to explain it, honestly. Okay, so now that rocket launcher makes sense, so... Okay, where is the tank? I hear, but I do not see. Where is the tank, man? Is that my tank? No, it's not, because I do not see it on my, on my radar, so... Let's see if I can grab another one. Can I kill it from here? Ah, I cannot because of that stupid rock, stone, whatever. Okay, let's go around. Man, he's still not dead. What the hell? Okay, next time I will go a bit closer. Or I will try to go from above. Depends. Maybe I'll go from above. I said I can climb this. This tank starts to annoy me. Survive this. Little bastard. Now it's your time. Yep, I missed a lot. I don't know if the, the weapon is a problem or mid, but I, I miss a lot and I do not like this. Okay, so my only way is through this patch over here. Go to sleep. Okay, so... Another tank? No way, man! Damn it, another one. Stay inside, Captain Foley. Let me do this. Captain Foley is my last... My last dude. Okay, I could use this for tanks actually, but... <clears throat> Thanks, Foley. And that was the epilogues. Super short. Festung Recogni. So, uh, yeah, well, it was short. That how it was created. Not my fault. So, thank you very much for watching. And I'm going to see you in the next one, which I think it will be the British one.